This tutorial will start on the Business Gateway website, which is gateway.ohio.gov. If you don't already have a, an account, you will need to first create an account in order to have access. First, you would need to input your email address and then confirm the email address as well. After confirming your email address, it will ask to send a PIN for verification. Once the PIN is verified, you will then move on to creating the personal information section. Here, you will input your legal first and last names and date of birth. The social security number field is optional. On the next page, you will be creating your username. Please make sure you meet the requirements above. And then next, you will be creating a password. Again, see the requirements above to make sure they are all met. Next is the account recovery, and you do have the option to skip this step. And lastly will be the terms and conditions where you can agree, and then you will have to answer a security question to confirm you are not a robot. Once completed, you will be sent an email about the account creation. And from there, you should be able to log into the Ohio Business Gateway now. We will navigate back to the Gateway's homepage, again, which is gateway.ohio.gov. We will log in and use those same credentials we just created. If you're logging in for the first time, it will then request you input your tax identification number or your social security number, um, whichever you use to operate your business. You will select it as your tax identification or FEIN number or if it is a social security number. Next, you will be tasked to give some information about the business. It will want the business's legal name, the state and phone number. The rest of the fields here are optional. After inputting that information, it should allow you to log into the gateway. Sometimes this page does glitch on new account creation and it will ask you to log out and log back in in order to get access to the full website as I'm doing here. If the logout button does not work for you, again, just type in the URL for the website, which is gateway.ohio.gov. We'll read you back to the home page and you can log in again and then you should have complete access to the site from here. The natural home page here is your My Business Dashboard. You should see your business name in the drop down below. And we're gonna click on the padlock to the right to begin giving ourselves access to applications we may need. The Minority Business Development Division is the service area you want. And then the transaction type, you will select any application from our office, the Minority Business Development Division, which you will want access to. Here I'm selecting a few of our most common used applications. After you have all the applications you want, the next you want to go to is the user authorization tab. Here you will be toggling on permissions for the application. You can do all of them at once as you see above, turn on the permission template and hitting copy permissions and then save. Or you can turn the applications on one by one below um, by turning the toggles on and then pressing save as well. Now you can go back to your home page and all the applications you toggled on should be reflected on your home page. You should be able to click on any application that is on your home page now and begin to complete the application from the beginning. 